Welcome to Bambulip. We are here in the Jupyter Notebook, so let's import the ports and passengers on the Titanic. Bambulip provides you with an interactive user interface, so you can scroll through the rows and change the data frame. Let's change the data type of the column survived into Boolean. We see that this worked and above is the live code export, so the code that Bambulip has written for you. Let's split the string and the column name into the last name and first name. We can see it worked and we can change the column name to last name. We can validate that this worked again. Next, let's have a look at the age column. Here we have some missing values. So let's drop the missing values. So we filter for missing values and drop the rows. Next, we want to add some more information. So we perform a left join with the ports based on the key embarked. Here is the column embarked and here are the two new columns. Date is a date time, of course. So let's change data type. And we see this worked. Now we can extract the date time attribute, for example, the name of the weekday. Let's drop the column embarked now because we don't need this anymore. And finally, I want to show you a group by. So we can group by peak class and calcul calculate the mean of survived. Here's the result. Bambulip also provides you with a history so you can undo the last step. Now let's visualize the data frame. First, you see an overview of all the columns, the data types, the unique values and the missing values. We can also have a look at individual columns. For example, the column survived, we see the distribution is 60 to 40. And we can have a look at the predictors. And the best predictor is the column sex. You can click on this and quickly inspect the relationship. Finally, let's have a look at the correlation metrics. So we can click on a cell, see the relationship, and even zoom into the chart. If you want, you can save the visualization for later. And you can also quickly adjust the visualization. And Bambulip will automatically adjust the visualization for you based on the data types. Here's all the code that Bambulip has written for you. And Bambulip also works on larger data with 1 million rows and 100 columns. So I hope you will give it a try and see you soon.